So this is the Sumeragi Family Evacuation Unit. It's a lot fancier than your standard unit. You think so? I know. We should tell Seto about this place and make it a safe house for Seto Platoon. It's like a little hideout. It feels perfect. What's a safe house? It's like an evacuation site each team has that's separate from headquarters. OSF refers to them as hideouts. They come in handy when we're faced with casualties like today. Oh, that's right. Gemma, let me see your leg. You're not fine at all. Look at all the blood. Stop trying to tough everything out. I wasn't doing it intentionally. I just couldn't feel the pain because of all the adrenaline. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, Yuito, you looked comfortable with medical treatments. I'm impressed. I had health problems as a kid, so I have a lot of experience taking care of my own injuries. I see. I'm sure your parents were pretty busy. Yeah. You know who my father is, and my mother was killed by another when I was five. We had a maid at home, but I just got used to doing everything on my own. It's good to be independent. Though not sure that's very convincing coming from me. Yeah, you could learn to do a few more things on your own, so Major General Fubuki won't have to worry so much. Major General Fubuki? What does he have to do with Arashi? I thought it was common knowledge. Fubuki and I are siblings. What? You're the Major General's younger sister? The other way around. You can't judge anyone in the OSF by our appearance. I'm Fubuki's older sister. Or she has the potential to rival even the Septentrions if she stops slacking off. How rude, Gemma. I just hate wasting my energy. What do you say we rest here? Even if we go back to Suo, all that's waiting for us there is paperwork and nosy crow news interviews. Hello, everyone. Hmm. Aren't you the daughter of the Ichijo OSF Hospital Chairman? Captain Arashi Spring? Call me Arashi, please. Every year you newbies have the same reaction. I'm sorry. Um, nice to meet you. I'm Hanabi Ichijo. The hospital is run by my uncle, who's the head of the family, so we aren't directly involved. I see. Well, I suppose it's best if both of us avoid connections to hospitals and pharmaceuticals. Hanabi, did you bring it? Yes, I brought medication and emergency rations. Were the supplies here in this unit that old? A lot of them were past their expiration date. I mean, my dad hasn't been to Ceyron in a long time, so I guess it's understandable. Oh, don't worry, Gemma. The medication and bandages I used on you weren't expired. <laughs> Thanks again for your help. You two seem close. Did you know each other before joining the OSF? We're childhood friends. Not surprising the Ichijo and Sumeragi families would be acquainted. Well, you've come all this way. Why don't you stay and make yourself comfortable? Y yes Sounds like Arashi calls the shots. She looks so different from the way they present her on TV. She's always lazy when she's not on camera, so a lot of people call her Lazy Ara. Lazy Ara? <laughs> that suits her perfectly. I heard you took down another major other. Oh man, I wish I could have fought with you. It wasn't broadcast this time. Weren't the crows there? 
No. A lot was going on. Want to talk? I mean, we're on the same team now. Okay, but what do you want to talk about? We've known each other since we were kids. You pretty much know everything about me. Uh, you know, we didn't see much of each other since joining up. I thought we could catch up. Catch up? I guess we haven't had the time to really sit down and talk. Right? Why don't we go take a walk out of the city? Okay, let's go. been on a relaxing walk like this in a while. Me neither. I've been on missions constantly since being assigned. We need to take time for ourselves like this now and then. So, what were you doing between the time you were scouted and the time you joined? Well, during my time at the Academy, I studied, trained my power, and hung out with friends. <laughs> Me too. I guess there's not too much difference between the scouted and volunteer soldiers. Yeah. We were both headed to the same place in the end. What about everything else? How are your parents? They're both doing great. Just the other day, they kept messaging me while they were on a date for their wedding anniversary. <laughs> They're so carefree. I'm glad to hear they haven't changed. I found myself ignoring their calls for a while. It feels nice to talk like this again. It's only been two years. But it feels like we haven't seen each other for much longer. Yeah, it really does. Are you okay? It's nothing. Anyway, can I ask you something? Sure. What's up? So, um, what do you think about Kasane? <laughs> huh? Why are you suddenly bringing up Kasane? Well, you know, we're catching up. I wanted to ask you something that must be on your mind. And it seems like you've been thinking about Kasane. A lot. It did? Well, I guess I've been curious about her. What do you mean by that? I don't know how to put it. I can't get Kasane's face out of my mind. You can't? No. Her face looks exactly like the person who saved me when I was a kid. I'll never forget that face. So when I met someone who had the same face, I started to wonder if they were somehow related. Oh, so it's just because she looks like the person who saved your life? Yeah, that's right. The reason why I even volunteered for the OSF is because I wanted to be like the person who saved my life. She's the ideal image of what the OSF should be. Wasn't exactly the direction I was going for, but I guess that's fine. Then what did you want to know? I'll try to answer. It's okay. It's not a big deal. You know, you're really amazing. You've had this goal since you were a child, and you've been working towards it all your life. <laughs> no, I'm not amazing at all. You're way more amazing, because you were actually scouted. That's not true. Being scouted meant that I had no choice but to enlist. You didn't want to join the OSF? It's not that, but I never thought about what I wanted to do in the OSF. That's so like you. You're more comfortable taking action than you are thinking. Hey, that seems like a roundabout way of calling me stupid. What? No, I, I didn't mean it like that at all. You just put more stock into being proactive. Wait, uh, that's not much better. <laughs> I'm just joking. I know what you mean. Ready to head back to the hideout? Yeah. Thanks for inviting me out. I'm really glad we got to talk like this again. 
I had fun too. Um, do you want to talk again like this sometime? <laughs> that sounds good. Let's do it. Okay, it's a promise. Don't forget. I won't. You better not forget either. I definitely won't. Well, let's head back to the hideout. She hasn't changed. She's so cheerful and energetic. I feel recharged. You haven't changed at all. Really? Really. I mean, you're still into Baki. But I'm a bit happy that you haven't changed. Just staying being you. together. A message from Kasane? I should check it right away. from Kasane? Maybe I can ask her a little bit about the person who saved me. <laughs> 